Still don't know what Palma raisins are. This is weird. It kind of looks like something out of a Calvin and Hobbes strip. Yeah, I bet I can guess which dog that was. Alrighty. Still don't know why that ends up being house on your head when you go through there. For no reason, I guess. Then there's that secret room over there I still really don't know anything about. But I'm going to have to figure it out at some point, I suppose, huh? to know what's up. <laughs> it's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprise. So they all have different explanations. But they say the same thing. Well, that one was more of a question. Well, never mind. I actually found something inside one of them. <laughs> Boy, I thought I spared you already. <laughs> the flowey the flower in the chat to give some context to anyone who watches it later and wonders why I said that. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's do this thing. Oh, right. Barks at me. Because reasons. Because the box hurt you. Eh. Yeah. <sighs> and then the protagonist was crushed. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> How did his tail go clear down to... Did a... I would say it's a mechanized suit of armor, but... Uh... Oh dearie me. Also, this is a very long rope bridge here. That, that seems very unstable to me. <laughs> yes, magical mechanized suits of armor. <laughs> Everything's magic. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> it 
It would just be a timing based thing, right? I could totally do that. So what's the dog for? Is that really going to, like, affect the trap? <laughs> Doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. <laughs> yeah. I just think you just couldn't get it to work. <laughs> Another decisive victory, yes. First Metaton messes with you, and then you can't get your traps to work. I think I've been through all of this already, but uh, I may as well go through it again. Been, been watching the skeletons do their thing a whole lot. <laughs> the goofy things. Boy, there's a lot of activity on the chat over here, isn't there? <laughs> Friend doesn't, one of my friends doesn't like the chat, says it's very badly coded. The more messages show up on it, the more it just starts locking up the browser. I think it's in Firefox, because Google seems to want to make everything work in Chrome and only in Chrome. It's kind of uh, irritating and slightly suspicious. <laughs> I should actually have some uh, defense. <laughs> it would probably be a good thing. I mean, last time I actually didn't equip any items at all. <laughs> YouTube has a green heart emoticon? Really? That's... that's a little odd. Oh, there's a lot of heart colors. That's... That's kind of weird. <laughs> anyway... Equipped manly bandana. Ah, so now the bandage is a healing item. So if you take it off, you can't wear it again. Huh. So... So I guess having the bandage at the end of the game means you didn't equip any defense items in the slightest. Well, that means another healing item for me, I suppose. And some actual defense. Hmm. 
That's probably a good thing to have. And this is kind of funny. That this Aiden lets you stay for free. Because you didn't actually stay the night. You slept for like two minutes. <laughs> like I said, the protagonist power naps. <laughs> And sleeping overcharges your HP, which is good. So a bunny named Cinnamon, and I have... Well, cinnamon bunnies in my inventory. Tch. Like I said before, again, yeah, because only kids wear striped shirts. Totally not anybody else. The uh, underground apparently has a Santa as well. I wonder what they think Santa looks like. These people are so mean. They won't let me join in on their poker games. <laughs> Think Librarbies. This stuff is locked until you actually go and fight Papyrus. We'll see if we can go through and, like, actually not get captured by Papyrus this time around. Last time it just happened so much and I said no to fighting and it just kind of skipped it. <laughs> I kind of lost on purpose after the first time, though, because I realized that, uh... Realize that, yeah, that, that it didn't actually hurt me, it just sent me to the garage. <laughs> doesn't have to rub it in that I'm lonely. Selfless, you want me to feel better about fighting you. I don't deserve such hospitality. <laughs> uh, he even takes the insults just fine. <laughs> oh no, you're eating all my stand. <laughs> You say the other, he ends up, he, had, he ends up th like you for your humility, humility, you know what I meant. I was prepared this time. <laughs> You're blue now. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. 
<laughs> I got to where he realized that he didn't have ears last time. <laughs> those things combined behind your ear would even do. That sounds gross and kind of just plain weird. And I still don't want to know what Bishy Cream actually does. There we- oh jeez! Anime powder? is anime powder. <laughs> Cute juice. Ugh. Traction slime. <sighs> okay. Beauty yogurt. Beauty yogurt. How does that even work? Then again, they have caffeinated soap, so I suppose anything is possible. Well, he won't change very much. Yep, he'll still keep. Ah. Dang it. Still keep cracking terrible puns, I'm sure. Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, they're changing now. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Ha! Preparing a bone attack. Who cares? Give up. I think you care, you old papyrus. Ugh. Put face by special attack. Still haven't got me got me past my overcharge yet. Go ahead and- ow. No! You got me past my overcharge. Too long and I will use that special attack. Boy, you're really building up that special attack there. This is your last chance before my special attack. Damn. How do I keep getting hit by this stuff? Behold my special attack! <laughs> the heck? <laughs> That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back, use my special attack! <laughs> oh well, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. <laughs> Pyrus is getting ready for a regular attack. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack! Dang it! Oh, jeez. That was pathetic of me. <laughs> what the? Ah! Oh. <laughs> what? 
Okay. <laughs> well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I have the great papyrus elect to grant you pity. I will spare you. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. <laughs> Something along those lines, yes. You... I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. Don't worry, Undyne can't stop me either. <laughs> Knowing Papyrus, he'll take it well no matter which option I choose. So let's just choose this option. Why would you berate yourself so loudly? <laughs> because you don't think you're good enough to be my friend. No, you're great. I'll be your friend. <laughs> uh, I guess I was right about that. If I ever found our first date, I've already managed to hit the friend so <laughs> To give people awful puzzles and then fight them. I don't... I think that's very good friend advice. Yes, yes, through the king's castle. Breaking the laws of physics again. <laughs> oh dears, are we having fan shipping in the chat? Oh dear me. <laughs> don't don't even get me started with that. That's just that's just weird. Please don't enter the mysterious shack. You're in your garage. I think if you don't flirt with it, it ends up being like a hangout or something, but uh, I'm not entirely certain. I haven't actually tried that. I assume he goes through all his attacks anyways. <laughs> I could be wrong. still don't know why you would have a sink that you can't even reach. <laughs> Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! And the food museum, which is really nothing but spaghetti. Please pick up your sock. <laughs> okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> Oh dearie. How is there quantum physics books inside joke books inside 
Either that's a tiny quantum physics book, or just magic. <laughs> do whatever people do when they date. Usually they go out somewhere, don't they? <laughs> Not that I'm the dating expert here, far from it. Complete opposite, in fact. <laughs> a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. <laughs> And of course, Sans would be trolling him. <laughs> A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. Humans have descended from skeletons, yay, that, that's always... Oh! Ow. Begin the date. Well, let's... <laughs> I can bring up the HUD early. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. Because... That's how dating works. <laughs> We're ready to have a great time. Let's see, step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. I think you already did that. Wowie, I feel so informed. Step two, ask them on a date. I wonder if I said no, he'd still go on. <laughs> A bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Well, yeah, I sure hope so. It'd be really weird if I wasn't wearing clothing. I don't know. All of this is useless anyways. And like I said, I don't know why the population graph would be fluctuating so wildly. That's, uh... That's a little weird. I'm just, I wonder about the opposite options in here. Despite that, he chose to wear clothing today of all days. So he chose to be predestined. No! <laughs> and it still works. <laughs> oh gosh, why is the tension meter fluctuating so wildly? How am I supposed to interrogate anybody if the tension meter is going all over the place? Oh no, wait, wrong game. I've never been beaten at dating and I never will. Well... Dating's not a competition, at least not with most people. Uh. That's kind of crazy prepared. I always wear different clothing, just in case someone asks me on a date. It's like... It's like tearing off your clothing to reveal a Superman uniform. <laughs> Your honesty is just... <laughs> no matter what you do, it works. <laughs> Ooh. 
Goku, it's not as strong as a monster. So the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. There's no secret to my legs, just hard work and perseverance. What about the socks? The last socks, right? I'm not entirely certain. What about those pants? Those are pants, right? Please, dear God, tell me the pants. Clear your hands, I'll tell you the answer. No, I must resist. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Did the shirt originally say dude on it? What? <laughs> what if I don't open it? You can't even bring yourself to harm my delicate wrapping. No, that technique. It's too strong. <laughs> Counter attack. I'll open the present myself. You know what this is. I don't remember what I answered before. Of course! Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh so wrong. Is it really plain old pasta? This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti finely aged open cask. Um... I don't think you age spaghetti. <laughs> I could explain the cooking. What if I refuse to eat it? You mean, you're letting me have it instead? Because you know how much I love pasta! Impossible! Taking my present and turning it around on me. Yeah, no matter what you do, you cannot fail this date. Oh dear. We talked about a friend zone earlier. This is what a friend zone is. You mean, I mean, if you couldn't, uh, you know, totally fail the date anyways. But you can't totally fail the date, so... This uh this went this goes a lot better than uh, a lot of relationships I hear about, so <laughs> Alrighty. Well, you can't fail the date at all. You picked a all the other options. <laughs> I suppose that means we should be going onward. I suppose. <laughs> and this guy never answers the door. You just knock again, he says something about his patience being rewarded. I wonder if there's anything out here. Because I was out here before and there was really nothing out there either. Maybe there's something you can do with it later, I don't know. Hmm. Uh, 
I didn't check the library this playthrough. I mean, I went through it last time. I suppose it wouldn't hurt to check it out. Yeah, it's all all the same sort of thing as as earlier, I think. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know the sign is misspelled. Yes, you are now a mix between a library and an Arby's. Actually, that sounds freaking awesome. I want to read a book while I eat. And I'll eat beef sandwiches. That sounds delicious and and entertaining and possibly educational. Well, I never know. Things seem to be slightly different in the second playthrough once in a while, so I thought I might as well check the library again. But it doesn't seem like there's anything real different. As far as I can tell, anyway. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? He's the coolest, right? Yeah. You've been on dying, huh? All that gives my life validation is explaining the echo flower. No one can know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um. Uh. <laughs> well then, that's uh. Dude, that's kind of a... Uh, never trust a flower. That's one of the constants of this world. <laughs> uh, I didn't check the echo flower first last time. <laughs> that's great. I mean, you see the code two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I thought you were running in an illegal hot dog stand. <laughs> sure. I'll come to Grillies again. You're going the wrong way. Where are all these shortcuts? Where are all these shortcuts? I was just here for breakfast a few minutes ago. <laughs> oh dear me. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Sans, you shouldn't make fun of yourself like that. Let's go with burger this time. Double order of burg. Berg? Like iceberg lettuce? So what do you think, my brother? What if I said uncool? Hey pal, sarcasm isn't funny, okay? <laughs> All these people just assume the one one sort of thing, no matter what you say. It's nice to call you a bit lazy, even though nothing can be further from the truth. Last time he drank the entire bottle of ketchup when I didn't want it. But, uh, yes. Tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours onto your food. Great! That's just what I wanted. I don't like ketchup all that well in the first place. <laughs> Forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Oh, you're a skeleton, right? I think he just scratched his non-existent ass. <laughs> anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. I think he's trying to be part of the Royal Guard. They went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard. He begged her to let him be in it. 
course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. The next day she woke up and saw him still waiting there. It's uh, still a work in progress. Warrior training with Papyrus. Yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Everything else froze. What if I said that I haven't? I'll tell you then. The Echo Flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them and I'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Paris told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, the flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Yeah, an echo flower. Certainly. Yep, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. What if I said yes to this? Just kidding. Okay, it's the same thing. I was going to say something, but I forgot. Good to know. I'd really like to know what you're forgetting to say over there. <laughs> okay. Well, I suppose it is time to keep on going. Actually, I could stop by the inn real quick, huh? I mean, the overcharge HP is kind of nice. Could have just used the tunnel. <laughs> yeah, I could have just done that. All right. And sleeping, unskippable, all that stuff. Or do I have to hit something first? I don't know, actually. If I do have to hit something, there's a bit of a delay. Okay. Do, 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 no, I have no why am I humming Zelda? I have no idea. Given that I've only played the first Zelda game. And yet I own Majora's Mask, but I never played it. Yeah, I own it in the box and everything. I found it at a store, game store, CD Trade Post. Was it a CD Trade Post or was it Game Wizard? Before they. Hmm. Cue the disbelief that I haven't played the Zelda games. Yeah, I've only played the first one. I'll get to them at some point, but uh, I'm sure one of these days. Yep, I've only played the NES one <laughs> and completed it. I've actually completed it. And I haven't played any of the other ones. It's it's weird. Probably something to do with the fact that when I had my laptop, the only thing I really had on the laptop was emulators for old consoles. So... Yeah, it was, like, it was the only thing the computer would run well besides some really old stuff. Anything like 
modern. It was like 450 megahertz computer, so it really, it was like it's like eight megabytes of graphics memory. It was a Pismo. So, uh, yeah. Kind of, uh, kind of just ran old emulations on it because that was most of what I could run on it. Besides the old Mac stuff that I kept on it because, well, you know me. <laughs> if you don't know me, I play a lot of old Mac stuff. <laughs> it's just, uh, it's kind of my thing. This is a bit of a, uh, a departure. I do play modern stuff too, but, uh, the main goal of my YouTube channel and such is, uh, these old obscure Macintosh things and old obscure other things as well. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this monster kid doesn't know that, uh, Undyne wants to kill me. Yeah, she considers me a bad guy because I'm human. One of those humans. As the Ferengi might put it. Well, uh... I might have to get another can of soda. This might be a good time to test out whether the ad function on live streaming actually works. Because what else am I going to do? Sit here. Because I was just going to sit here doing nothing. So, I will be right back. And this part will probably just be cut out of the Let's Play later. But hey, this is the stream. So yeah, I will be right back.